kitchen, studio, and wall beds, etc. Proud to offer Edmonton the best quality and service. Working hard to make sure all products are sourced locally. Now you see it, now you don't. Visit wallbeds-etc.com today. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another edition of the Nielsen and Fraser Post Show, show brought to you by our friends at Wallbeds, etc. Now you see it. Sure. Now you don't. Wallbeds-etc.com. What say you? Sure. What say you? Sure. No, seriously, what say you? No, seriously, sure. Okay, it's game day. Eskimos, Riders, Commonwealth, 8 o'clock tonight, and we had our listeners join us to give the Riders fans some respect. Respect. That, respect, Jeter, respect. Uh, respect that they deserve. Right, because the Eskimos did a commercial and riled up their fans, and we thought, no let's, respect. Let's do a bunch of Sunshine Girl profiles suggesting all the great things that Saskatchewan can bring why, to the table. Why wouldn't you want to go home? Here are some examples of ones that were sent in today. Go, Phrase. Sunshine Girl Stevie, this six foot four, one ninety six pound bombshell, is a green eyed, semi a unibrow husky. This ex riot rider cheerleader likes long walks in endless fields of Saskatchewan. And bench press. After a long day of throwing bales of hay, nothing turns her on more than a candlelight dinner in the barn with her brother. Shotgun and a pilsner and enjoying a 17-ounce steak really puts her in the mood. For what? For lovemaking. Probably, That's what? Probably for seconds. Sunshine girl Wendy Lynn hopes to one day move to the big city, Regina. She enjoys the feedlot near Lanigan, drinking Vico and mining potash. Her dream vehicle is... One she owns. See, so these are some of the examples of ones, uh, ones right. that we had. Yeah, Sunshine girl Bernice hopes to one day graduate from grade six. This 5'2 stout 46-year-old's favorite phrase to hear is, I'm sure it's just a bladder infection. You can tell your cousin the same thing. <laughs> when she's not teasing her hair, she can be found searching for mountains. <laughs> one more, one more. Let's just do one more. Sunshine girl Christy is a blue-eyed blonde from Prince Albert. Her likes include ice fishing, hanging out at the Dairy Queen, and Chris Getzlaff. Her dream vehicle is a Massey Ferguson, and one day she hopes to do a cover photo shoot for the Western producer. Lieutenant Eric is a Riders fan. Yeah. Eric, uh, ready for the big game today? Yes. He has a Sunshine Girl write-up for an Edmontonian. So slide on well, up here. I get it, because we've kind of been... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Respect. I, yeah. So now we're going to let you fire back for all, of, for all of Saskatchewan. Go. <laughs> all right. No, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Yeah. We'll, uh... Yeah. <laughs> wow. Thank you for your contributions. You're welcome. Let's uh, let's get to an email. I don't know where the horn is. Somebody probably stole it again. <laughs> Stop sneezing and hand me the email. You're a horrible person. Hey guys, did you know that the Riders once blew a great cup because they had too many men on the field? Signed, Teddy. What was that? What? When did this... There's no way that could have happened in real life. Eric, you never told us about this. When did this happen? There'll have to be consequences. What say you? Sure. That's going to do it for another edition of the Nielsen and Fraser Post Show. Thanks for watching. Go Eskimos! You ready?